Hello everyone, Gentoo was already very good with text to video, but now they have come up with something truly amazing, image to video generation. This will really change the way we generate AI videos. In today's video, I will talk about how to use image to video and what is the best way to write prompts for Gen 2. I will also share my chat GPT prompt, which I have written specifically for Gen 2 and some tips and tricks that I learned after spending a lot of time with this tool. Let's get started. You can try Gen2 on runwayml.com or uh, to sign up, you can just go ahead and use your Google account and create. Once you log in, you will find, you know, you have Gen2 option over here. Click on this. Then there are some basic information how you can use this platform. One second of video is equal to five credits and you will get around 525 credits and you can go ahead and start using this Gen2. Let's have a look at the prompt structure first, which is very simple. We have two sections in the prompt and we add in the style of between those two. So first section is initial base prompt, which define the primary concept of subject derived from the provided keyword. Second is the style description, which described about cinematography, dynamic movement, and kind of 2D animation or other things. Okay. And then there are some basic uh, example of the prompt, how the prompt should look. And then there are some basic information about the prompt structure. So I took the prompt, I provided to GPT-4 model, and my keyword was C waves. So you'll find that it has created three prompt and each prompt has this text in between in the style of and then we have style description on the right side and in the left side we have the subject description. So let's take one of the prompt here and we'll go to runway ML and provide our prompt. So here I'm just providing the prompt. There are no image reference and there is a free preview option. So once you click on that, it will give you four preview option in which you do not use your credit. And if you like any preview, you can generate from there. So you can see that we have four preview here. So if you like any one of them, you can go ahead and generate or you can directly generate over here. So I like this one. I'll just go ahead and click on this generate. Let's have a look at the result here. Uh, you could see it has created a really amazing video and the frame interpolation are, is also really good. So there is no, you know, distortion. We have a very smooth transition between the frames. So this is really good. And you can go ahead and rate the video if you like this. For the next example, we will be using the same prompt, but this time we will be using some reference image. Okay, so let's go ahead and click on this. I'll go ahead and select this one. So now our image is uploaded over here. Let's go ahead and click on free preview. Let's see. So you can see here it has taken some reference from the image and generated a preview for us. Let's go ahead and click on this one and generate. Sometimes what happens when you use image as a reference, what it does is it just create the camera movement, but there will be less movement as a part of the uh, subject. So let's see what kind of result we get. So our video is ready. Let's have a look at the result. This is really amazing. Uh, if you use any image reference, it works really well. But let's have a look at the image first. So this was my reference image and you could see here. This is what they have taken from the image and created a video out of that. Okay, now imagine you want to have a video which look exactly like this. So how can you achieve that? So there is a trick. What you need to do is just remove the prompt. Just keep your image and just go ahead and click on generate. So there will be no prompt here. It will use this image and add a motion on that. Let's have a look at the result here. Now you could see this looks exactly like our image. So if you have any image generated using mid journey or any other AI tool, just fed the image to runway and let's runway do its magic. All your created result will be saved under this asset folder. So you could see here I have created another video here and here you'll find all the details about your uh, generation. If there are any input details, if there are any referenced image, so you could see here that I've used this referenced image and this is the video which I was able to generate. Look at the result. This is really amazing. You could try. If you like this video, hit the like and subscribe button. Share with your friends and I'll see you in the next video. Thank you.